Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel Vertex Manoj Roy. Matrices, uh, we are starting exercise 6.1 from the additional mass book. Before starting 6.1, I would like to say what is mean by matrix. Uh, matrix normally we write with a capital alphabet, like A, it can be B, it can be C, it can be M, it can be P, whatever, and equal to and with the square bracket. And we can write like two, three, or we can write one, two, three, four, or we can write also with this bracket five, six, minus two, three, minus one, zero. So, this first of all, when a matrix is like A equals to with this bracket one, two, three, four. I just want to give an example. This is called a form of matrix, and the bracket we can use this bracket or the square bracket. This is called columns. And how many columns are there? There are two columns you can see. If you see this part, there is only one column. In this part, we have two columns. In this part, we have three columns. So, this is the way we should know what do you mean by columns. And second thing, we have this part, like here, this one. This is called the rows. How many rows are there? Two. So the column and rows, like we have. And this is called the members. Like we are having the elements or the members. And we can also have one more type of matrix. Only six is written there. It can be like this one, two, and five. It is possible, or six you can write is possible. So, this is the first way. This is called this matrix in this form we write. And if you are talking about the order of the matrix, because as we are doing exercise 6.1, so the topic is matrix like what is the order of the matrix? So, when you want to find the order of any of the particular matrix, the order is always equals to row multiply by column for example this one if I, if i'm talking about this matrix how many rows are there two rows and two columns so two times two is four please don't write just write two by two we write two by two so what is the order of this matrix a uh, like we, you can see the number of columns like one column and two rows so we can write there are two rows and there is only one column, so order will be equal to two by one. Here, if you find there are two rows, so we write two by and column are also choose two by two. This is one, like two rows, two by, and how many columns are there? Three columns, you can see there are three columns. So write two by three. This is one by one, and this is one row. And how many columns? One, two, three, four columns are there. So this is the way this uh, we can and like here uh, understand what is uh, a matrix and what is mean by a matrix and what is mean by order of the matrix. Let's starting with question number one of exercise six point one, and I'm also six point like one question one and two together. Uh, in this part, if you see, if you need to find the order of the matrix, order of each of the following matrix. So I'm just writing the order here. Directly, we can write one row and three columns. So we write one by three. This is two rows and how many columns? One, two, three, four columns. This is one, two, three, four by two. This is one by one. And this is three by one. We cannot change the position of order, please. Always the row and then column. This is two by one and we have done it uh, then we are moving to question number two in question number two uh, just to like this is very simple exercise uh, we have the mathematics uh, distinction students are there score distinction 65 percent who scored the distinction so it means i will write 65 here 
and who did not uh, get the distinction it means the 65 total is always 100 percent so this will be 35 because 100 minus 65 is 35 and the second part in class b we have 55 so we write 55 here so this will be 45 because minus from 100 and then we can do the next is C means you can see here this class C we have 52 person uh, score distinction so we write 52 here and 48 here and we have done it this is a way like very simple questions are there in exercise 6.1 order and okay if we are talking about this part uh, this is very simple part now I am doing two questions together so once again uh, is given in the question in the class of 30 students 16 are boys and 7 home wear glasses okay 16 boys all together and we're talking about wear glasses to so 7 wear glasses so what how many students who like boys who, who do not wear glasses so you can do 16 minus 7 is coming 9 so that's all together 16 and 8 of the girls in this class wear glasses so 8 of the girls i can write 8 here as we know the total are 30 like when we add 7 plus 9 plus 8 like or you can do one thing 16 are boys so minus 16 you can get there are 14 who are girls so 14 girls means 8 is there so 8 means you will write here uh four, like sorry 6 and we have done it if you want to see the answer you can check the answer of this part question number uh three question three we can see uh seven eight nine six seven eight nine six and they also were asked to write the order so order is was the order of this matrix the order is two by two uh in question number uh, four like uh they're asking uh, a drink stall sold 160 cups of coffee all together 160 cups and 125 cups of tea and 210 glasses of soft drinks on monday on okay uh actually we have to make uh, like a matrix we have to decide a matrix and the matrix can be like a two by two three by three or whatever so we have to check first of all how many days are there monday is there then we have we can do one thing uh monday tuesday and wednesday yeah three so we can write monday tuesday wednesday or you can write monday tuesday or wednesday there is no problem whatever whenever like here position is not the problem in the matrix actually you have to decide yourself so monday i have decided this is monday this is tuesday and this is wednesday and we have coffee we have coffee and then we have tea and then we have soft drinks so we can write drinks you can write soft drinks so i think so is a three by three matrix so 160 here t is 125 and 210 and tuesday is 145 130 145 130 and 275 we have to make the matrix then on wednesday 120 cups of coffee 120 is there 155 is there and 325 and we have done three by three matrix there is no problem with it uh in question number five and six when we do together uh in question number five once again we have the same thing here like uh, we have to make a matrix uh holiday package and malaysia and the thailand okay on the okay this is once again the june then we have on in june in july or in august okay so we can do one thing uh we can write june july and august so this is we can make like three rows 
first of all and we are not sure how many columns to make let's see yes columns are two i think so because there is only malaysia and thailand we do not have any other country write a matrix i think so yeah if we have we can make it i am not closing the bracket here so 143 and six and 105 in July 65, Malaysia 65 and 46 for Thailand and in August 122 for the Malaysia 89 for the Thailand and there is nothing other matrix so order is raw material column 3 by 2 and we have done it. In question number 6, uh, we have 4 by 3 matrix, you can see yes this is 4 by 3 matrix and please do not multiply okay uh, we have to decide in the right should the pitch price of the dollar or the fruit juices per glasses at the very stall the rows represent the fruit juices okay so fruit juices okay then we can write one thing this this one this one this one are the fruit juices like uh watermelon this is watermelon I'm writing in short. This is orange. This is papaya. And this is honey dew. Okay, then we have done it. Okay, what we have to do now? Other part is given the column represent the stall A, B, C. Okay, the columns, this is stall A, this is stall B, this is stall C. Okay, A part. How much does a glass of orange juice cost at stall B? At stall B, orange is this part. So we can write A part. Answer is dollar one point eight zero. B part. At which of these three stall is a glass of papaya cheapest? So papaya is here, and uh, which stall one point two in stall? Okay, at B. We can oh, sorry at A we can write A is the right answer. The papaya juice is cheapest. Lim bought two glasses of honey honeydew juice and three glasses of watermelon juice from stall C. Okay, we are talking about stall C now. This is stall C, and his uh, Lim bought two glasses of honeydew. So we can write this one two glasses, and how many glasses are for watermelon, this is watermelon, three glasses. This is three glasses, and this uh, like two glasses. So we can write one thing like two multiply by 2.20 because two glasses, and we can write plus three glasses of the watermelon. So when we add, it's coming 4.40. When you multiply, and it's coming 4.50. All together, it's coming 8.90 dollar. And we have done this question number six. So, in last question of exercise two nine, like six point one. Uh, where possible, where possible, remember where possible because we are, we have one thing here is called, uh, we have equal matrix. Okay, what is equal matrix actually? Equal matrices are the matrices which have like, which have the e like same order. Same order, then all the elements of the particular position will be same. Same order is very important. First of all, I would decide which is possible. This is possible. Uh, this is 2 by 2, 2 by 2 possible. This is 2 by 3. And this is 2 by 3. This is possible. This is not possible because this is 3 by 1. And this is 3 by 2 matrix. This is possible because this is 3 by 2. And this is 3 by 2 possible. This is also possible because 2 by 3 and this is also 2 by 3 and 
f part 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, this is no 5, 1 by 4, and this is 1 by 5, this is not possible. So, uh, I have one question from everyone. Uh, at the end of the video, I would like, I will give one question, and please write the answer in the comment box, the order of this part. So, uh, when we have a equal matrix, it means 6, 6. Okay, when one more thing to check before starting, sorry. Uh, all the elements which are given should be also same. For example, 6 and 6, same. A and, okay, we can do because everything is same. So, B is coming minus 2. We can write B is minus 2. A is 4 and C is 5 because and 6 and 6 both are equal. If I am moving to this part, you can check one thing. 1 is C. A is 0, B is 4, 9 is 9, minus 2 is D. This is possible. So you can write A is 0, B is 4, C is 1, and D is minus 2. But okay, this is not possible. In this part, let's check. Order is same, but members should be also same. A is 5, B is okay, minus 2. Okay, this is possible. We can write A is. 5, B is minus 8, C is minus 2, and D is 4. Okay, that's good. Uh, in this part, uh, be careful. This order are same, but it's not, it's also not possible to do because uh, this position 6, 6 equal is okay, but this minus 4 and 2 that gives us, like, give us the you know, this. Uh, Let's, these two matrices are not, not same because the members are not equal. So that's very important. Equal matrix with same order but same members. So we have done it. So what is my question? That's please write what is the order of this matrix? Please write in the comment if you know. The question is 1 plus 2 plus 3. What is the order? Thank you so much. I hope this uh, this video is useful for you. I have, we have done exercise 6.1 matrices. It, it was very simple about the order of the matrix and equal matrix. So once again, please share with your friend. Thank you so much and have a nice day.